In the interest of transparency, I must disclose that this video does have AI in it. More specifically, any dubbed in narration prior to a clip from the live show is done with an AI text-to-speech clone of my voice. Everything else is made by real humans. Hello the people, I am M. Page, and I am a big dumb stupid idiot. Here is a compilation of clips from my previous Wheel of Fortune stream on Twitch that prove I am a big dumb stupid idiot. Uh, spin it. Well, isn't this a great start to the stream? Ha 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 ha! Crap. Tell me why. Tell me why these computers are stupid. Player one, over to you. Tell me why I can't think of words that rhyme with stupid. Tell me why. I I wanted to sing. I did it any. Are you kidding me? This game hates me. Player two, you're up. <sighs> Let's give this a spin. Maybe the game didn't like my singing. Everyone's a critic, I guess. One thing that becomes more apparent the more time you spend watching my stupid face is that my stupidity is not an act. Here is an example of my stupidity stretching as far back as my youth. Now. When I was a kid, I was always paranoid about saying the answers. Fuck! I was paranoid about saying the answers out loud in case the computer could hear. But now I know I'm a grown-up, and that's just stupid. It is around this point in the stream that DigiGex90 appeared in the chat. He is a really cool friend to chat with, but sometimes he brings bad luck to my streams, as demonstrated in this clip. Player one. Hi, Gingy. Are you kidding me? Why? 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 But even DigiGex90 can't be blamed for how badly I suck at games, because sometimes my failures come from a headspace of overconfidence, like in this clip here where I appear to be doing really well in my score. I'm just packing it away. Just packing it away. No, 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 no! <laughs> Uh, why? What was the prize anyway? I wasn't paying attention. Give me a C. No! They stole my good letter! And you're gonna fucking solve, aren't you? Oh, I'll spin, Vanna. Oh, I forgot. Normal players don't solve until all the consonants are gone. Is there an M? There it is. 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 Speaking of overconfidence, do you remember that one highlight from a long time ago where I solved the puzzle with no letters on the board? As you are about to see, that moment was clearly a fluke, as I have attempted to replicate such a feat on stream, but to no avail. Alright, I might as well do that thing where I scare people by solving puzzles with no letters. Let's see if it works. Let's see if I magically know it. Porky Pig. Can't help you this time. Sorry. Nope. Player two. Well, that didn't work. I'm not quite sure how to describe this next clip, but I will warn you that the next two minutes are going to be incredibly boring and painful to sit through. Oh, that jackpot looks good. I just gotta call the right letter and make sure I know what I'm doing. Uh, taking the something on something vacation? Um... Taking the family on something vacation. C? Good. Two Cs. Listen to how hard I try to solve the puzzle here. It sounds like I'm having a stroke, or perhaps like I'm some sort of free online AI generated voice that malfunctioned halfway through the paragraph. Taking the family on. Ah, uh, what kind of vacation is it? On child tier, on celebrity, celebrate, C E L E B, no. Uh, 
Collective, C-O-L-L-E. No. Um, taking the family on... Ah! <laughs> what kind of vacation? It's a competitive, competitive, come shut up. Uh, co collection, connection, conceptual, con, con, see, con, sa, Cur curtains, collabs, clear, clear, and uncondom, bundan, day, bundan, day, gang, you gang, and a circulative cinco, the the fuck it spin. But what's more fun to watch than my own pain and suffering? That's right, Digigex 90 laughing at my misfortunes. Okay, I just gotta land on the jackpot again. I, I'll get closer yet. No, 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 fuck you. Oh, no. Shut up. Anyways, here's the part where I finally figure out the puzzle, long after my turn had already ended. There was an H in there? On Chocolate Vacation? On Chief Town Vacation? It's not Chinatown, there are no more ends. Let's give this a spin. Chinactual, chinactual, ch chocolate, ch chin, ta chin tower. How about an S? Good, two S's. Oh, I just got it. It's fuck. It's Christmas. Fucking Christmas vacation. They didn't call the R. I didn't see the R. I'll take an M, please. And now I'm and I'm stupid. Why is it all my best tricks don't work when I stream? Why is it I always look like an idiot every time I go on to play this stupid game? I'm ready to solve the puzzle. I'm ready to solve the puzzle. I'm making page my greatest life choices. <laughs> but there is one universal truth about my audience, or at least about Digigex90. He likes seeing me rage at games, as I assume everyone else on the internet does. So here's what I assume to be a satisfactory clip for this purpose. People. People. People are scary. Player one, over to you. Why? Oh. Here's my new alphabet song. Why, 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 why? Ignore that. There was a moment where somehow, by some miracle, I made it to the bonus round. Listen to how hard I try to solve the puzzle here. It sounds like I'm having a stroke. Oh, great. None of those things. Uh, kin. Beankin. Munkin. Munchkin. Munchin. Panchin. Poonchin. Pound. Poundin. Wound, wound on, wound on, bound on, uh, Jean John, uh, Benjamin, uh, Ankerin, uh, phone in, uh, um, win. Winkin. Uh, I don't know. Uh, hmm. Quinton. Uh, Chunkin. It's 
not right. Chunkin. Nope. Opinion. Yeah, I picked the wrong vowel. One thing I always hated about the tournament mode of this game is that if you only have one human player, there are moments where the CPU players become so good, you barely actually do anything in the game. It just plays itself, and it makes the rare moments where I actually get a turn even more frustrating when I lose that turn almost immediately. Player one, over to you. Oh, now I get to play. Uh, let me see, uh... Uh, King of... Wait, I think I know this one. Like, I know the bonus word. Now I wish I knew what the puzzle was, and I don't even get to play! Hooray! Oftentimes I can be described as a sore loser, because one thing I tend to do to cope with the idea of someone being better than me is to catch them on some stupid technicality that somehow proves I'm superior despite the fact I barely did anything to impact the game. Of Diamonds? Kong? Of the Hill? Okay, that voice actor messed up. If there is one positive spin I can put on my endless misfortunes, it's that when it comes to games, the bad luck usually proves to be consistent, almost to the point where I can predict where the game will screw me over. Player one, over to Oh, now I can have a turn. Watch, I'm going to, I'm going to hit the bankrupt, aren't I? Yep. Keep in mind, I'm doing you guys a favor by cutting this stream down into highlights. If I did not, the video would be way too long, and the majority of it would consist of me staring at my phone because the CPU players keep hogging all of the turns. I'm ready to solve the puzzle. I didn't even get to do anything! Bruce Boxleitner and Melissa Gilbert. Who the hell is Bruce Boxleitner or Melissa Gilbert? I don't know any of those people. I don't know any of these people. Oh, I'd like to solve the puzzle, please. Oh, what now? Barbara Billingsley as June Cleaver. Why do they keep pulling up shit from like the 60s? But thankfully, I am nothing if not merciful. So here is a clip of me knowing when to quit. This game stinks. Stop. Ah. That's it. Uh, stick a fork at me, I'm done. Um, wildcard friends will be all I do from now on. I'm canceling all future solo live streams because I cannot take any more of humiliating myself in my favorite games, boring people over my favorite games, or raging at crap to a piece of crowd that never shows up. Damn, I don't even need the AI for that one. Oh well, my work here is done. I hope you enjoyed this video, which is way better than anything M-Page could have made. Thank you for watching, and you know what? I got something I want to say before I go. You know how M-Page always says, if you're American, remember to vote? Come on, we cannot kid ourselves with the current political climate. And I'll tell you what you should do. If you're American, unregister to vote. That's right. Contact your local county clerk and tell them you no longer wish to be registered to vote. Why? Because when you're not registered to vote, it means your crazy left-wing, right-wing relatives can't use your identity to duplicate the votes and make their favorite unfavorable candidate win. That's my piece, and I will catch you all around. See ya.